My First Cigar by Robert J. Burdett, read for LibriVox.org by Francis Brown, www.francisselvey.wordpress.com. It was just behind the woodshed, one glorious summer day, for all the hills the sinking sun pursued his westward way, and in my safe seclusion, removed from all the jar and din of earth's confusion, I smoked my first cigar. It was my first cigar. It was the worst cigar. Raw green and dank, hide-bound and rank, it was my first cigar. How bright the boyish fancies, wrapped in the smoke wreaths blue. My eyes grew dim, my head was light, the woodshed round me flew. Dark night closed in around me, black night without a star. Grim death, methought, had found me, and spoiled my first cigar. It was my first cigar, a six or five cigar. No violet torch could e'er the scorch. It was my first cigar. All pallid was my beaded brow. The reeling night was late. My startled mother cried in fear. My child, what have you ate? I heard my father's smothered laugh. It seemed so strange and far. I knew he knew, I knew he knew. I smoked my first cigar. It was my first cigar. A giveaway cigar. I could not die. I knew not why. It was my first cigar. Since then I've stood in reckless ways and dared what men can dare. I've mocked at danger, walked with death. I've laughed at pain and care. I do not dread what may befall neath my malignant star. No frowning fate again can make me smoke my first cigar. I've smoked my first cigar. My first and worst cigar. Fate has no terrors for the man who smoked his first cigar. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain.